is one thing teenagers have always been good at. Being super cool. No, it's not that. Having the best time ever. Not that. Throwing really great parties. Not even close. It's coming up with weird ways to waste time. Flagpole sitting. Um, so in the 1920s, Avon Foreman, who's only like 15 years old, set a flagpole sitting record of 10 days, 10 hours, and 10 seconds. Uh, what? I bet his butt hurt. Dance marathon. Goldfish swallowing. Goldfish swallowing started in 1939 at Harvard University where some rich guy named Lothrop Withington Jr. swallowed a live goldfish for $10. Panty raids? Panty raids started in October 1952 at the University of Michigan campus and spread like wildfire all over the country where college guys would get together and raid girls' dorms to steal their panties. Boys are so gross. Peanut pushing. Yeah, that existed. This all started with a guy who pushed a peanut up Pike's Peak, which is 12 and a half miles or almost 20 kilometers for all you people who use kilometers, with his nose, and it took him 30 days. Kissing competitions, because if you don't know how to make out, then why not make it a competition? Get this. Vincent Toro and Louise Heath held a kiss for 96 hours, 30 minutes, and 3 seconds. Hope somebody brought some chapstick. Phone booth cramming, which is impossible to do now because there are like no phone booths anywhere. Thanks a lot, cell phones. Perhaps the most dangerous teen fad. Car surfing. This fad started in the 1980s, but it's recently become popular again, and it is deadly. According to the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention, between 1990 and 2008, 58 people have died from car surfing. So if you want to surf, then surf on water, not on cars, okay? Marathon handholding, which I'm surprised isn't a part of abstinence-only sex education here in the United States. Oh. I really hope the commenters are not offended by my depiction of a teen teenage girl from probably the 80s who has a lot of opinions, okay, and speaks with a very particular inflection because I'm not trying to degrade teenage girls and their thoughts and opinions. I'm just kind of having a fun time talking dressed up like this and with a foil in my mouth. <laughs>